Happy New Year. The Recruitment Doctor is back again for 2022. And I wanted to start off by talking to you about hiring strategies once again. It's a new year. Everyone's going to be thinking about budgets. Everyone's going to be thinking about how they're going to bring in some new talent as they scale, as they grow, as people leave. So I just wanted to give you my four top components broken down and what you need to think about when it comes to your hiring strategy. Number one, setting up and planning. So who do you need? What do you need in terms of people and skills? Budgets, prioritization, which roles are you going to hire for first and in what order? Which roles are going to take the longest when it comes to bringing new talent in? Interview planning, who are you going to take out of the business to go and spend time interviewing because we know it takes time? Resources in terms of bringing those people in and interviewing and making the time to find those people. My second part, conclusion. When you've done this, how are you going to scorecard those interviews, scorecard that talent? How are you going to utilise key performance indicators? How are you measuring cultural fit, personality assessments? And when it comes to offers and onboarding, onboarding includes retention, marry them together. Thirdly, recruiting channels. How are you going to manage those talent pipelines? Are you going to use a spreadsheet? Are you going to invest in a CRM? Who's going to do it? Are you going to do it internally? Are you going to go and bring an external recruitment partner, talent partner on board? Or could you do a mixture? Are you going to utilise job boards? Are you going to use some a budget to, to spend on paid advertising? And finally, more important than anything, market research, market intelligence. What's the competition doing? What are they paying? Speak to the local tech communities, or if you're not in the tech industry, your local industry, speak to the communities around your networks in in your city, in your region. But more importantly, what is your employer brand? What is your value proposition for 2022 when it comes to attracting and engaging talent? Because if you don't have a story, your competition are guaranteed to. Have a good start to the new year and I'll see you soon for another Recruitment Doctor.